Here's how to deactivate your Facebook account on your iPhone. Now, if you wanted to take a break from Facebook and deactivate it, I'll show you how to do it. But first, hit the subscribe button down below. It really helps me out. Thanks, guys. Now, let's open up the Facebook app here, or you can go to facebook.com. Now, the first thing we need to do is navigate to your settings. So to do that, we're going to tap on your profile button at the very bottom right. Now, to get into your settings, all we need to do is scroll down here and you can see settings and privacy. Now, just open that up and you can see it opens up with settings. So let's just tap on settings. Now, once you're in here, it's fairly difficult to just naturally find where to deactivate your account, but I'll show you two different methods to find it. The first one is you can hit the See More in Account Center. Now, once we're in here, you can see midway down is Personal Details, and you can tap on that. Now, another way, if you don't see that, or if they move it around, which they constantly move it around, all you need to do is hit the Search button, and then we're going to just search for deletion. Now, when you search for deletion, you can see midway down is account center and personal details. Just tap on personal details here. Now, once you're here, you're able to deactivate your account by tapping on account ownership and control. From here, you can see deactivation or deletion. Just tap on that button. And then, of course, this is for Facebook. So let's choose Facebook. Now, you want to choose the top one to deactivate your account, which is temporary. You won't permanently delete it, and you can always get it back down the road. Now, let's just hit continue here, and it will ask you to enter in your password again. So let me just autofill my password and hit continue, and I'll show you what it looks like from here. It might ask you why you're doing it. It doesn't matter what you choose. Just hit continue here. And now this is important. At the very bottom, it chooses to reactivate your account by default after seven days, which is fairly obnoxious. I would recommend tapping on that and choosing don't reactivate automatically. This will only reactivate it if you go back in and reactivate it yourself. I'll show you how to do that or walk you through the steps. Now let's hit done and then just hit continue. Now you can see confirm temporary account deactivation and on here you can see continue using messenger. You can check that if you do want to use Facebook messenger, you just don't want to use the facebook.com or Facebook app portion. You can choose to check that or not. Let's just uncheck it. Now at the very bottom, all you need to do is hit the deactivate my account button and your account will be deactivated. It's super easy to reactivate your account. All you need to do is go back to the Facebook app or facebook.com and just log into your account. And just like that, everything will be reactivated and restored as if you never left. I hope this helps. If it did, hit the like button down below and leave a comment if you still have any questions. Thanks guys.